Hello guys, welcome back to Appendices Club. Today we're going to solve another tutorial name called Rapid Scan. So what is this a Rapid Scan? Rapid Scan is the multi-tool web vulnerability scanner. So what are the main features we can get in this uh, tool? So it's a one-step installation and execute a multitude of security scanning tools, does uh, other custom coded checks and print the results spontaneously. Some of the tools include like Nmap, uh, DNS Recon, uh, WAF and Uniscan, SSL Analyze, FireRise, uh, uh, LBD, Local Balance Detector, the Harvester, Amos, and Nikto, and etc. Some other all tools is available. So it saves a lot of time instead of lot uh, to check each and every time every time with the, all other tools. Check for the same vulnerabilities with the multiple tool to help you at zero and false positive effectively. Extremely lightweight and not a process intensive. Legends to help to understand which uh, test may take longer time. So you can make it as control C to skip uh, for instead. Uh, association with the uh, OS job top 10 and uh, CVE of our top 25 list of every of the top every year. So critical and high and medium and low informational will be classification of the vulnerabilities, vulnerability definitions and guides you what is the vulnerability actually is the threat is uh, it can pose remediation tell you how to plug or fix and found the vulnerability, execute a sum uh, summary, give you an overall context of the scan performed with critical high and low informational issues are discovered. Artificial intelligence to deploy a tool automatically depending on, upon the issue found for example like automates the launch, WP scan, uh, plea cost tools when WordPress install is found under development. And detailed compressive array report in a portable documentation uh, in a PDF with a complete details of the scan and tools will be used. And the run of Metasploit auxiliary modules to discover more vulnerabilities here. Now, we would like to look this. Now, first open the terminal. You just type as git flow and let it press the repository. Rapid scan, then go to as a rapid scan, type plus. So you just type as sudo su, enter your password, you just type here as python3, set up dot python and install. That is done, you just type clear. Now you just type clear here, plus. Now you just type here as python3. Rapid scan of Python. Now you would like to type minus minus help. So where you need to enter rapid scan dot example dot com. Scan the domain with the example. Then you can also uh, you can see here here is an critical requires immediate attention. It may lead uh, to a compress compromise of service unavailability. And hi may not lead the immediate compromise, but there is an considerable chances for probability and attacker may correlate a multiple vulnerabilities of this type of launch a sophisticated attack then go not a serious issue but the recommendation to tend the final then info not clarified the vulnerability simply as useful for informational alert is considered okay now we would like to test as http dot vulnerweb.com now we would like to test this at targeted this one let me test here so all tools is available each and everything that will be checked automatically here dns recon everything it will be checked now you can look here
So it may take a little bit of uh, time uh, to provide all the information here. Let's see here. So, uh, we wait with your patience, then we can get to this one without a fail. So it may take a long lengthy time process to stack any of our targeted website also. It works similar like a Nisos, uh, the same way, but it's a fee. When you go for Nisos, you get a, a 30 days for a trial period, that's it. Here there is no required for trial period, but you can get everything here as free in the rapid scan. So here also you can look here the multi-tool uh, web vulnerability scanner. Check out our new software for network for simulating for BDOS attacks. We try here uh, this one BDOS copy. We would like to look this also. So we would like to try to look this first. So uh, what are the main vulnerabilities? It will try to uh, check in this. So the vulnerabilities will check in this, like a DNS of HTTP uh, load balancer and web application firewalls. So it will also detect here. And uh, check for Zoomla, WordPress, and Drupal of targeted websites. And SL related vulnerabilities like Heartbleed, uh, Freak, uh, Poodle, CSS, Injection, Logjam, OSSCP, and Stackly can be also done. Commonly open ports uh, will be discovered here also. Then DNS zone transfers using like multiple tools like uh, uh, 5C, DNS walk, DNS record, DNS enum also will be discovered. And we can also see here uh, subdomain bullet forcing like a DNS map, uh, AMAS, NICTO, everything will be identified here also. Then uh, we would like to look also uh, like uh, open directory files by bullet forcing. Uh, also will be done. Now also it will check for a shallows for access and SQLI and blind SQLI banners will also check. Then also it will check like uh, Solaris's uh, DDoS attack, local file inclusion, remote file inclusion, and remote code execution will also will be identified here. So it's taking a two long lengthy time process this one. Here also you can look here netboard. So uh, we would like to look 
here this is a netboard total boards is connected so you can test the software in a single machine itself but ultimate point of the software to deploy a client boards uh, a different machine and the server codes on your machine very important make the ccc server address on netbios client python port else a uh, port will not connect to your ccs what is this a vertical command and control center for ddos and botnet simulator and load generator so that's it so it will take a long lengthy time process so i'm just uh, putting here so you try it your own guys thank you guys for watching and keep smiling